Hello once again everyone, Original Blood Ace back again, and this time we're talking about Target. Most of you probably are aware of the store called Target, since it's quite much more popular in the States than it is here in Canada, and anyway, this story only affects us Canadians. Target will be shutting down every single one of their stores in Canada. All, or all, 133, which doesn't even seem like that much to begin with. So, first of all, for me, I've never even bought anything at a Target. I don't even know if I've ever even been inside a Target. However, what are we supposed to do about the Rosalina Amiibo, huh? Now, granted, I've already mentioned I don't even have a Target in my city anyway. But, with this happening... Actually, first I should, I should explain why this is happening. Apparently, uh, Target in Canada tried to do way too much, way too fast. They haven't even been here or maybe two years in Canada. And uh, basically, they've been expanding, 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 making more and more stores. But they've been stupid and not actually, uh, you know, keeping up with their suppliers. So basically, they're opening up all these stores that hardly get any merchandise. So people will go in there, and there's people who, in Canadians, that have t uh, taken pictures and posted it on social media, Twitter and whatnot, and they're just like, oh, look at all this, the shelves are all half empty and everything. So basically, they bit off way more they can chew, or bit off more than they can chew, um, as well as they underestimated the Canadian, uh, Canadian market, at really. Because Canadians don't shop like Americans, uh, or even Europeans, um, but yeah, kind of a shock, but at the same time, it's their own damn fault. Uh, so I really hope that Nintendo, you no longer do anything <laughs> Target exclusive ever again. In fact, you should just completely ignore Target and don't even give them anything Nintendo related. But of course, you're doing stupid shit again this year. We're starting off with stupid shit, so I wouldn't be surprised if, who knows, maybe Nintendo would be like, uh, for their ninth gen console, Target exclusive! I mean, that'd be the most retarded thing ever, but still. Uh, so, first, or for me personally, this doesn't really affect me, except for trying to get a Rosalina Amiibo. I was going to see if I could get a friend of mine or whatever to get one for me and just mail it to me or something, but whatever. Um, it sucks, but at the same time, I don't know, it's kind of like Blockbuster, really. Uh, you all remember Blockbuster, don't you? Now, I loved Blockbuster. And much like Blockbuster, it was closed down in Canada, but the states got to keep theirs. Now, I don't know if they're still in the states, though. Uh, but to me, this is kind of a similar situation. Because for both Target and Blockbuster, I blame the Americans. <laughs> uh, but, uh, yeah... I lost my train of thought. <laughs> I guess I should explain why I blame the Americans. If you look back at Blockbuster, the Canadian ones were always doing fucking, fucking, fucking fine, you know? But then the States ones had so much debt, and for some reason Canada was like, oh, we'll take the debt for you, and then uh, the American ones got, a, got off without any debt. And then that killed off the Canadian ones, and then obviously the American ones got back into debt and it killed it off. Not to mention stupid fucking Netflix, which I still can't fucking stand that shit. Uh, <laughs> and then, of course, now with Target here, uh, kind of the same thing. I mean, they expanded into Canada. They basically replaced a store we had called Zeller's. That was our equivalent, and Zeller's was actually not a bad store. Uh, I'd shopped there quite a few times throughout my life, and... Uh, you know, they were not my first choice for a store, but they were pretty good. Um, but yeah, so they replaced uh, Zellers, and then all of a sudden now, poof, they will be gone as well. Um, oh, and also apparently their competition was another reason for Target not doing well in Canada, because apparently like Walmarts are a big success here in Canada, and uh, there was some other one. It was like a website, an online buying website called like Lobjaws or something. It was something weird I never even heard of. But yeah, that's about it, I suppose. I don't really need to go into uh, any more this video. Um, 17,000 employees will be out of work. Uh, it'll trigger a 5.4 billion quarterly loss. Uh, so that's really going to 
suck for them and the 17,000 people who just get fired or let go I guess um, yeah I guess that'll do it I'm original blood ace as always stay tuned for more videos coming soon we'll see you next time